Hi, I'm Dennis Coffey. Uh, I'm a guitar player. I've uh, played on many hit records for just about everybody, Motown and Detroit acts and uh, different acts in LA and so forth. Uh, I decided what I'd like to do is go back uh, to basics to do another album and go back to my roots, which was back uh, in the first album I did called Herring Things. And uh, so that's what we did. We recorded this record back in Detroit and just cranked it out and getting back to basics. things we decided uh, with this album is that we were going to add some vocal songs to it because normally I do uh, mainly instrumentals and one of the ways that made sense to us is if we're going to do that why don't we do some cover songs that have some vocals in them and um, then another decision we made is well if we're going to do that why don't we just do songs that I had played on the originals to begin with so that it would still uh, be representative of my music so that's what we ended up doing. One of the songs we recorded was uh, All Your Goodies Are Gone by the Parliaments, which I played on. And uh, we got this uh, great singer, Mayor Hawthorne, to do uh, a vocal on this. I also agreed to do three cuts for Mayor on his album, and so we're in the studio, and uh, he's kind of singing guitar parts to me. And it's... And I said, Mayor, I said, the last guy that did that was Stevie Wonder, so. But I says, I guess if I can do it for him, I can do it for you, so it's very cool. Another song we decided to do was uh, Don't Knock My Love, a song I recorded in Muscle Shoals with my buddy Wilson Pickett. First thing that came to mind is, well, I don't think we're going to find a male singer that can really do what Wilson used to do. So we uh, chose a, a female singer, Fanny Franklin from L.A., and she just did a great job on it with her interpretation. It just sounded great. Another song we decided to do was I Bet You by the Funkadelic and uh, my buddy George Clinton and the whole idea was uh, uh, we would use some local Detroit great singers, uh, Mick Collins and uh, Rachel Nagy and they just did a bang up Detroit job on that song and again, you know, I'm all about Detroit, that's where I made most of my records. Can I bet you, the Johnny Mann's very first words is hell, can I bet you, if you bet on a horse and a horse don't win. We worked on 100 Proof Aged in Soul song, Who's Been Sleeping in My Bed. And we had Lisa Cola from the Bell Rays, a great singer from LA, and again, a classic Holland Dozier and Holland 70 tune. Can't get a better backbeat. Yeah, that's it. On the originals, we took a little different approach. We went back to the hair and things vibe that I had uh, with the first album I did, but we made it contemporary. We had a lot of young cats here in Detroit playing on it. Uh, the only difference was uh, there's one song I wrote called Miss Millie that I wrote with Kings Go Forth, a uh, great Milwaukee young funk band, so that was the one I collaborated with. Most of the other songs is just what I do, you know, so we got together and just jammed it out and of course uh, uh, made in Detroit, that's what was happening. What I plan on doing now from here uh, is to play out and get in front of the people as much as I can. Uh, beginning in June, I'll be playing the festivals uh, in Europe and, and a lot of uh, different club dates. We're going to be out there bringing the music to the people. What we're going to do on our shows is, of course, we're going to play the new material from the new album. Uh, also, I'm going to do some of my hits like Black Belt Jones and Scorpio, and I'm going to also do some of the records I played on Motown and other hit records, all going to be part of the show.